Good morning and welcome to OCD. Welcome to my workshop. So what am I up to today? Well I'm a bit bored and uh, I've come out I've looked at my car and my car is smothered in dust. It's not it's not dirty it hasn't been on the road since the last time I cleaned it but it's it's dusty and it annoys me so I want to do something about it. Um, it's um, nearly 26 degrees it's uh, midday not the right conditions to wash or clean your car but I'm going to do mine so what am I going to do first thing I'm going to do is to get the dirt and dust off and I'm going to use that I'm going to use it I'm going to do that with I've got a solution of ONR uh, in a spray bottle um, and I've got two gallons roughly two gallons of water and I'm going to put some uh, ONR um, into that so uh, what you do, you add um, an ounce of this into two gallons of water. So we do that. And the cap is half an ounce. So put an ounce of product in there and a little bit. I guess I like a little bit. So that's the solution. Now I haven't got one of the um, ONR big super red sponges things because that's just extortionate amount of money um, so what I tend to use is I use these creature towels um, rag company creature towels we stick three in there so stick them in and let that let them soak for a while so that's how I'm going to get the dust off the car um, I don't know whether you guys have used ONR before. I've used it for quite a long time and it's it's very underrated. It's a really good product. You can use it for so many things. Um, if you're into detailing, you really ought to have a bottle on your shelf because it's so adaptable. Anyway, that's enough of the advertising. Um, and I bought it myself. I, it wasn't sent to me by ONR. Um, or Optimum, shall I say. Um, so... That's my solution in my bucket. I've got warm water because I'm a softy. Um, so warm water. So I'm going to go over and spray the area with ONR solution, um, which is the same strength as the what's in the bucket. Um, I then um, wipe it down gently with my creature cloths, and then when I finish, I'll just go over with a drying towel before the water dries on the car. If you find the water is drying on the car then by using the spray just go over it and keep keep it alive don't let it dry because you get water spots because of the hard water um, unless you're using um, deionized water um, but I'm not I'm using it out of the tap so if you find it is starting to dry or in danger of drying just keep it alive by by going over with a spray and then when you when I finish what I'm going to do is um, the car is well protected anyway but I and ONR, I, I don't know whether it leaves a, a protective barrier on there or not, to be honest. Um, but what, I'll, what I will do is I'm going to use Infinity Wax Optic Show Wax. Now, um, go back into my videos some point last year, I think. It was the hottest day of the year. Um, and I put this on in full sunlight. Um, I think it was over 30 degrees when I applied it. This Optimum Show Wax you can put on in it doesn't matter how hot it is or direct sunlight it's it's very effective um, it doesn't last particularly long probably a couple of weeks but um, if you're going to clean the car like I am today you clean it put a bit of protection on so that I think we're expecting a bit of bad weather in the next couple of days it's got protection on it so uh, ONR use that in in the direct sunlight no issue Optimum show wax use that direct sunlight no issue 26 degrees, I'm going out to clean the car. So uh, come with me and uh, see how I get on. Okay, so first thing is just to give it a bit of a spray.
squeeze the towel out. Don't you don't want to squeeze all the water out. You fold it in the four. See that dirt? And then use the other side. Inside out. Then get as much of the water off as quickly as you can. Like I said, if you uh, if you see it dry, so if you start to see it dry, then you just give it a couple of more squirts to keep it all alive. It's drying quite quickly in this heat. That noise you can hear in the background is some uh, bunting from uh, VE day yesterday. Looks a bit better already. So I'm going to do that all the way around the car. But having demonstrated that, what I'll do now, I'll um, show you what the uh, what the wax is like. Okay, so this is uh, optic show wax from uh, um, Infinity Wax. I bought this. Um, at last year's last year's um, wax stop last year being 2019 it depends when you're looking at the video so just Cloth out. Doesn't take any effort. I'll go over the rest of that and that's it that's how I clean my car in the hot weather pretty as a picture that's what it's supposed to look like so there we go guys really uh, just a very quick video just to really show you what's going on in my workshop today just in case you thought I was sitting in the garden with my feet up and a couple of cold beers 
that's next. Um, but uh, you know, I can't, like I said, I come out here um, just looking for something to do. Saw the car all dusty. Thought that's just not, it's not good enough. I can't relax. Um, and that's what I do to when I clean the car in a really hot weather. Saves water spots, saves aggravation. Um, and like I say, that wax isn't particularly long lasting, but it'll do until the next time I, I clean the car. Um, it's very easy to put on, very easy to take off. And if you check the video out that I did um, back in the lot, or no, it's about the middle of last year, obviously, it was about 30 odd degrees. Um, wax goes on, that wax goes on easy in the, in the hot weather, comes off easy. Um, so there we are. I just hope uh, that's of use to you guys. Um, let me know in the comments below whether you think uh, I'm just talking about old rubbish uh, or, or whether you've tried it or if you haven't tried it what do you do in hot weather um, anyway you let us know and uh, you take care till next time bye bye